Oh, all right, the Elegoo Centauri Carbon again. We got an issue and I, I'm calling this a slicer problem. I don't understand why this was a group of parts that is 20% uh, infill. This is a group of parts that's 80% infill all on the same plate. When the slicer ran, they all were sliced together. These, which have a larger base, got brims all the way around. These that have very tiny contact on the bottom don't have a brim. And that means that a couple of them came loose. And you can see it's just kind of printing in air. And I'm leaving them sit there because printing onto that lump, I'm guessing, is better than printing into thin air where it's gonna get all tangled up when it moves to the next item. I think that's actually gonna be better than picking them up so that the filament can go somewhere. Uh, but this is, uh, it's disappointing in that I should have noticed that the slicer put a brim here and did not put a brim there. I just wasn't paying close enough attention. So there's your warning. If you're printing things that are larger at the top than they are at the contact area with the build plate, go ahead and put a brim. That's what we call this little area down here that is just extra material that it's put down to help keep everything stable so it doesn't fall over. Looks like two of them, maybe three of them fell. Looks like three fell. Hopefully nothing else falls. Maybe I should move them so they don't knock anything else over. Leave a comment. What would you do in this scenario? I think I'm gonna have to take them out just so they don't knock the ones beside them over. Yeah, what do you think?